minute. Why haven't we discussed about the most important topic in poultry production? Some of you may be like, what are you talking about? I am talking about water. Uh, we haven't discussed about proper strategies on how to give water to our broilers. In this video, I have shared with you why water is so important in broilers and why it could be the game changer for you as far as improved broiler production is concerned. In this video, I'll also tell you what affects water consumption in broilers. And finally, I will share the proper water management practices to employ in your broiler farm so as to make sure your broilers are drinking the required amount of water for optimum growth and performance. Guys, as you all know, it takes a lot of time, energy and money to organize all this information and to make you these valuable videos therefore if you haven't subscribed to this channel make sure that you hit the subscribe button and also hit the bell icon so that you can be notified whenever we post a new video make sure also that you hit the like uh, button because that is very good for the youtube algorithm also if you have any question or suggestion make sure to leave a comment in the comment section below what is so important about water when it comes to broiler production. Water is the most important nutrient for overall health and performance of commercial broilers. Water plays an essential role in every aspect of metabolism in broilers. That is, water helps to hydrate the body of the broilers. It also helps in digestion, uh, helps in secretion of waste, uh, respiration. It helps to lubricate the joints of the broilers and also, most importantly, it helps to regulate the body temperatures. As a farmer, you cannot do much about the feeds that you buy from the feed stores. But one thing you can do and that is in your control is about uh, the water you are giving to your broilers. You can be able to manipulate the factors around water consumption in your broilers to boost production. Feed consumption is directly related uh, to water consumption. If you do not give enough water to your broilers, uh, this will definitely lead to a decreased uh, feed intake. Water consumption is very important in the sense that it can tell you if your broilers are sick or not because the sick birds will not will have a decrease in water intake a two kilogram broiler chicken will drink a lit, uh, nine liters of water in its lifetime as compared uh, to around 5 kg of feeds. This means uh, that water consumption is twice uh, the consumption of feeds. That uh, being, uh, having been said, let us discuss about the factors that affect water consumption or water intake in our broilers. Number one is environmental temperatures. Uh, water evaporation through the respiratory system uh, of the broilers, also known as panting or mouth gapping in layman's language, is one of the main ways birds regulate rate a body temperatures during heat stress conditions. Broiler increase water consumption approximately 7% for each degree increase in temperature. Therefore, make sure you increase the water supply to your broilers during the periods of heat stress. The second uh, factor that affects water consumption if in broilers is the taste of the water. The taste can have a big impact on water consumption in broilers. Chicken have a keen sense of taste and they prefer water that is slightly acidic. Adding vinegar in their drinking water will increase water consumption, therefore boosting production. Number three is temperature of water. This applies during the heat stress conditions where you should give your broilers cool water. That is, uh, the temperature of the water should be lower than that of the environment. This will help to maintain good water consumption, therefore reducing heat stress effects in the broiler's body by helping to control the body temperatures. Number four is about lighting. Uh, lighting can also affect water consumption in broilers. Whether it's artificial or natural lighting, it will definitely affect water consumption. In natural light, water consumption increases during dawn as the sun comes up and the birds start being active. Water consumption also hits the peak at dusk uh, as the light levels begin to fade and birds increase water uh, intake just before bedding down for the night. This pattern also repeats in artificial lighting where water consumption will increase when lights go on and when the lights are about to go off. The birds learn what time uh, the lights go off and 
they they will increase water consumption just before the lights go off therefore whenever you make any changes to your lighting schedule always change the on time and not the off time so that you cannot interrupt the intake pattern the birds have established at bedding Number five is about feed availability. Feed availability will have a major influence on water intake. Feed and water are very closely related. Birds will drink little water if no feeds are available. They will also eat little or no feed if they do not have access to water. Now let us discuss on the proper water management practices to employ in your farm for optimum water intake at your broilers so as to maintain and boost growth and performance of your broilers. The first thing that you should know is that you should distribute the drinkers evenly throughout the whole house, alternating them with the feeders so that they are easily accessible to all the birds. No bird should walk more than 1.5 meters to get either the feed or the drink. Number two, you should wash and disinfect the drinkers daily. Ensure that the drinkers are filled with fresh water after washing. Also, you should ensure that all the birds uh, have access to wholesome drinking water at all times and never allow the drinkers to go dry. In hot periods, it is essential to provide the flock with cool water as this will improve productivity. It is therefore extremely important to protect the water tanks from direct sunlight or ensure uh, that they have a reflective surface. We have discussed that chickens, including broilers, like a water that is slightly acidic. Therefore, click the video on your screen right now so that you can be able to know how adding organic uh, acids to the drinking water of chickens uh, will boost uh, production and performance in your broilers.